Hi everyone, welcome back to Riverside Eats. We are having to have a zen moment because if you can tell, we are um, having all of our stuff. We're moving it. We're, we're moving out. We have to be out of our RV park in a few days. So we're trying to do it early since our work schedules aren't gonna work with the actual day of April 1st. So we are moving out a little bit early and it's kind of a mess. Code is really stressed out. He uh, hates when we move a bunch of stuff around. He gets really flustered. Um, but yeah, this is currently what our whole setup looks like. Um, we are going to be moving our camper into my sister's driveway for about 20, 21 days. And then, um, we're going to visit family and friends before we head on our trip to Montana. Um, so this is just a little vlog of moving and packing up and all that. Okay. Day two of moving. It's a lot, uh cleaner now that yeah. you um we kind of left you out of the hard part it was a little bit stressful <laughs> but as you can see we've got the boat on top of bailey's rig yep got the boat on top of mine because it won't fit in the back of griff's truck but um but we're about to hook up and hit the road and go back to Austin for a little bit. But yeah, it's, uh, it's a little sad in here. It's just um, kind of blank. Oh, this morning um, we had a little incident. So I usually have like, I have this curtain and I had a matching one over here, um, but we accidentally uh, spilled my leftover red wine from yesterday um and it splattered all over one of our uh decor pillows and <laughs> the curtain so now we gotta get a new curtain but that's a minor problem um so everything's down we put the tv in the bunks and um basically anything up here basically everything is going in the bunks um so that's good and now pretty much all we have to do is put our pizza oven in the car and then our portable washer. And the washer then has water in it. So. The washer has water in it? I guess. So we need to drain it. Um, but other than that, we're about ready to go. Um, it's kind of sad, our, um, our little friends that we've made here at the campsite are all bummed a little bit because we're leaving today and they're all leaving Thursday so it's kind of sad because we've made some cool friends but if we come back in the fall after Montana um, I think all of them are coming back so we're gonna all try to get our same spots um, so that way we can hang out and have fires and do all that stuff um, the other day we had um a pizza night so i made pizzas for everyone um which is kind of cool hang on i'm gonna put you down for a second okay here we go i'm trying to plug this in and drain our washer um but yeah that's kind of what we're doing we're just moving and it's a little sad but really excited to go to montana we just have a few more things to do um, but more like technical stuff like paperwork for his license and um, he has to do like a CPR class and stuff. But other than that, we're good to go. Are you ready to go? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Sh we shouldn't do the whole side on one side. Just do a little bit right there. That was scary. 
our whole trailer like moved. <laughs> I guess it has the wheels, so it's fine, but that was a little scary. Cody, are you stressed out? Coda doesn't like moving very much. He just gets stressed when we have all of our stuff out, but he's going to be um, very excited when we go to Montana. just kind of um, weird to like move uh, you know just to another state for a little while and then move it back and um, you know if we decide to move back and all that kind of stuff it's just kind of crazy um, that we can take our house to wherever we want it's just kind of cool um, you know and we didn't really think about that like you know, we kept thinking like, oh, do we need to pack this, 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 like, because it's our first time kind of moving. But then we were like, no, we literally have our house on the back of the truck. So <laughs> it's just kind of uh, funny. But anyway, um, so we're going to drive to Austin. I should probably keep my eyes on the road. So um, we will see you in a little bit. We have moved into our first driveway for the next 20 days or so we will be on this unlevel driveway but it's gonna be okay right what? it's gonna be okay and then we're on an unlevel driveway yeah it's gonna be fine totally fine cool but what are we gonna do tomorrow? Oh, I guess I have organize, to work. work. Yeah, organize. just organize. Just work. Or just kind of get stuff. Just gotta work, work, Littles. work, work, work. Well, folks, we made it. And the only thing that went wrong is I smashed my pinky. Oh. On the bars that go here you have to get the bars off well I tried to pull it and the pressure all went onto my pinky so didn't feel very good but so the moral of the story is use the bar but the bar is scary too because you have to get We'll we need a video. One day, yeah, because it's too complicated to explain. But main problem: this doesn't want to set down in here and come out very easily. Yeah, this is the lock to the hitch, and it just gets stuck. I don't know what is wrong with it. I wonder if it has to be exactly level in order to unhook either. I was thinking about that earlier. This is where we're at. Yeah. So. Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> and in one month, we're going to be less than a month. We'll be in Montana. We will be in Montana in the mountains. Mon-freaking-tana. Okie dokie, y'all. So, we will 
See you on the other side. It's been a long day, but um, thanks for watching and